Greetings friends, welcome again back to my uh, game room. I'm David McCord and today I would like to bring you a uh, little information about a game called Shisima. Shisima is a game from Kenya. Um, it's one of the three in a row games uh, similar to uh, in the same family as uh, Tic-Tac-Toe, uh, Tapitan, Aki, uh, Three Men's Morris, that sort of thing. Uh, of course all these little games in this genre have uh, their own unique features and challenges. The name Shisima in the native tongue in Kenya means body of water and uh, the pieces in the game are called Mbalavali which means water bug uh, because of the way they scurry around on the surface of the playing board. Those of you that are interested in ancient games will recognize this game as exactly the same game as the ancient Roman game Rota. The rules for Rota, like so many ancient games, are purely speculative, but they're the same as Shisima. Let's learn a little bit more about Shisima and how to play the game right here. Players decide who will play which colors and who will start first. Traditionally, the lighter color goes first. Each player's three pieces are initially set up next to each other in a row on the outer points of the octagon on the opposite side from the other player's three pieces. This leaves three empty spaces, including the all-important center space. Each piece can move one space at a time, following the lines on the board. Only one piece can be moved per turn, and obviously a peg cannot share the same hole as another peg. When a player moves their pieces into a three-in-a-row pattern that uses the center position in the pattern, they win. If a player is forced to repeat a formation three times in a row, the game is declared a draw and nobody wins. As usual with a lot of games of this type, uh, because it goes so fast, you might want to play a series of games, uh, and play best three out of five and that sort of thing. Um, but it's a fun little game with uh, nice little choices to it. I uh, hope you check out Shisima on uh, the Peg Pastimes Facebook page, website. Um, we're available online, of course, at uh, Red Hen Toys, and you can check out the rest of the Peg Pastime series there uh, when you get the opportunity. Of course, I encourage you to subscribe to our channel here. Be sure and check that little bell so that you can uh, get notification when we have uh, uh, new games uh, being taught or uh, new information about games in general. And uh, we thank you very much for your support. And so meanwhile, as I always say sometimes, be sure to play every day.